Hey, what's up guys? So I'm doing another video right now about uh, stock market strategies. Uh, I think I'm going to make a series about this. So whenever I find some sort of strategy in the stock market, uh, I guess I'll make a video about it. So the first one is Finviz. Now, Finviz um, is very important because of the heat map. So right here, you can see the heat map of the S&P 500. And there's two ways you can infer this. Well, there's two, way, there's two ways you can infer this heat map. Uh, one way is that uh, you can follow the uh, well, you can follow the trends of the stock. So, for example, you're a Tesla bull and you see that it's run up fifty percent, and you still think there's room to go uh, to buy it. Uh, you can do that, but <clears throat> That's not how I uh, use this. So the way I use this is to sell off the green parts and to buy the reds. Now, obviously, I am not going to buy every red stock because sometimes it's red for a reason, right? So you are going to have to do your own research on the stocks. And maybe you have a larger circle of competence for me. So maybe you're in the healthcare industry and let's say you know about Pfizer stock or something. So that could be very useful. For example, uh, let's say you work in banking, right? And uh, you think that Schwab is going to go up. So you can do that. And the other thing with Finviz is that they have a news section. So... I used to run a YouTube channel called The Market Recap. I'm still uh, quite burnt out on running it, so I stopped doing it. But the way I found news was I used Finviz uh, over here, the news, and the other one was the maps. So the news uh, gives you a lot of information from Bloomberg, Wall Street Journal, Market Recap, Market Watch, uh, CNBC, and Yahoo, which is the ones I use uh, most of the time. But you have other sources like Reuters or Fox. Uh, other than that, you have Seeking Alpha. And I think that's it. Yep. So those are the ones I look for. So what you're going to do is whenever you find an interesting stock, and if you use TradingView, you can just save it over here. So um, Let's say Oracle is down 3% and I look at the technicals and I found that this is favorable after doing some research, of course. Uh, so yeah, that's one strategy and it's using Finviz.